This is kind of a practice video, calculating the units from the slope on a graph. This video is going to show you six graphs, one after another. For each graph, calculate the units of that graph. Pause the video when you see the graph and figure out the answer before continuing to see the answer itself. Here's the first problem. Here's the first graph. Question is, what are the units of the line's slope? Pause the video and calculate it. All right, if you're looking at it, units of the rise divided by units of run, so it would be meters per second or m over s. Second question, what are the units of the line's slope? So you've unpaused or done the calculation. If you look at it, units of the rise divided by units of the run means the units of the slope are newtons per second. Third question, what are the units of the line's slope? Pause the video. At this point, you should find the calculation uh, the units of the slope, units of the rise divided by units of the run, so it's pascals over a meter. Now, a little bit more difficult problem. What are the units of the line's slope? So at this point, you should have figured out the units, or at least thought about it. Unpause the video, and here's the answer. I want to take a look at this. This becomes meters per second over seconds. Units of the rise are a fraction, meters per second, divided by seconds. So how do I deal with that? Well, i got to remember that dividing by a number is the same as multiplying by the inverse. So I can take meters per second, which is in the numerator, and multiply that by the inverse of the denominator. That's like dividing by seconds. So meters per second times 1 over seconds. Now it looks easier to handle. All the top multiplies together, meters times 1, and seconds times seconds to give me meters per second squared. So the units of the slope on this graph are meters per second squared. Next example. What are the units of the line slope? Pause the video and calculate it. Hopefully you've done the calculation to find the units. So let's take a look at it. A fraction on top, non-fraction on the bottom, so kilogram meter over seconds over meters. The numerator is a fraction, the denominator is not. So remember, dividing by numbers is the same as multiplying by the inverse. So kilogram meter over seconds times 1 over meters. The meters actually divide out, because I got meters in the numerator and meters in the denominator, which means this becomes a kilogram second. So the units of the slope of this line are a kilogram second. Last example. What are the units of the line's slope? Even though it's a curve, it's still the same process. Units of the rise divided by units of the run. So meters per second squared divided by minutes. Dividing by the, a number is the same as multiplying by the inverse of that number. This becomes meters per second squared times 1 over minutes. So now it's easy to see how these, everything lays out. It's all multiplied together. This becomes meters divided by second squared times minutes.